This is one of these times where I start to feel like I can't believe I get paid to do this. This is Jewel. Uh, I'll tell you why I'm holding her in a second. All this week, we are bringing you the best of 2009. Everything from products to pop culture to advances in medicine. Today, we're looking at the year's best for pets. And here with that is America's favorite vet, Dr. Marty Becker, with two furry friends. This one, this guy's name is Snoopy, and this is Jewel, and they are from the Humane Society of New York. Ready for adoption. Ready for adoption, if you uh, want to give us a call. Uh, let's talk about some of the things you've seen this year that you like the most. Well, first of all, the portable pet home by PetMate. I love this thing. It looks big here. It comes in six different sizes. It folds flat enough to fit in that little container right there. So well, it's only like incredible. an inch and a half thick. Great for taking it to the hotel, going to the veterinarian, in the car, you're at the beach. Has little zippered panels here. Good for ventilation, keeps the bugs out. And then nice. your pet misses you. You work a lot, Dan, right? I do. Your pets, your dogs, or cats miss you the chatter bowl by contact. What I like about this is it's not only a food grade for food or water, but you can also fill it with your words. So it has a little electric eye and a little voice recorder thing here. Listen to this. You're the bestest boy. Ooh, we make Katie proud. <laughs> <laughs> so I recorded that with my own voice. Uh, so here's my question. I have a cat, Ruby, who does not like me. And if I had my voice on her bowl, she would never eat. <laughs> <laughs> you better get somebody that it does like. Probably your wife, right? Exactly. Uh, th now let's go to, to talking about some medical things, some high-tech things. This is made by Light Cure. It's a companion therapy laser. This actually start, technology started out with animals and now is transferred to humans. Fifteen major league teams, major sports teams have this. World Cup teams teams in the Beijing Olympics it was used for the equestrian what, team. What does it do for you? What, it, what do you use it for? It reduces pain and lymph inflammation and speeds healing. Like for a dog in the veterinary hospital, over 600 veterinary hospitals have it nationwide, had a chronic ear infection, I would use this laser here in the mm. ear, uh, anywhere from one to three to five minutes depending on the size of the animal. I would use it, let's say, for a sore shoulder, insect bite, arthritis, uh, spay and neuter incision, dentistry after dentistry, reduces pain, inflammation and speeds healing. And it's now being used on humans amazing. With the technology went from animals to humans, yes. And what is this here? Okay, the bad bugs, super bugs, right. the MRSA virus. A lot of times we found out, they tested, the uh, New York Times, they, they did this study, they tested households, 50% of households had MRSA in it, and you're eight times more likely to have it in your house if you had a cat. Really? Like Jewel. Wow. So what you do, there's a new product here from Dermapet called uh, Tri Trizcolor 4, and it actually has this mixture of products that actually kills uh, the methicillin resistant Staph aureus. What I like about this product, it comes in a shampoo for dogs, but if you have a cat, you simply spritz it on the cat. It's a leave-on spray. You can use it as often as you want, but it kills the MRSA virus. And again, this is the bug that is resistant to, to antibiotics. To normal antibiotics. Okay, you got dogs. They love plush toys because it has a give to it. The only mm -hmm. problem is if you're like my daughter's pugs, you rip the stuffing out of the toy, <laughs> literally. So this has a, a rubber scaffolding inside the toy, so it doesn't have stuffing. So it has that kind of collapsible give to it, so when it pushes right. down, it bounces back. But also also, if you notice inside there, the squeaker just floats with inside there. So there's a little squeaker in here. But it floats inside there so they don't target it for no destruction. No reaction from Snoopy to this. Squeak. Snoopy. <laughs> Interesting. Well, Snoopy's 10, though. He's a little bit weak here. Oh, I see. Jewel, <laughs> Jewel's just uh, unhappy to be held by me. Other than that, she Now, Jewel's going to love this. This is from our pets. It's called the Play and Squeak line. They actually recorded the sound of an actual field mouse. So when you listen to this... Well, take a listen. But look at this one right here. You drop this down. So at random, this thing will comes. If the thing works here, here it comes. It's liven up here. Well, the good thing about this, there's always a playful predator oh, inside every okay. cat. Look at that. And so what I do is get them more <laughs> active. And so you get this, this ball of fury fury here goes around, and so you get the cats more active because 50% of America's pets are overweight or obese. So really? you have to have finds a way to get them more active. So great line of toys. Marty Becker, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. This is fascinating stuff. Uh, I'd be tempted to take this guy home. Except for, uh, I might be um, opening myself up to superbug infection. Right? I, hope, I hope you're wise. Actually, you know what we always say about pets? Get rid of the risk, keep the pets. So you don't see veterinarians dropping dead from zoonotic True. diseases. True. But we do need to be careful. Thank you, Marty. Appreciate it. And Snoopy and Jewel, again, came to us from the Humane Society of New York. You can find out much more about adopting beautiful animals like this one. And also Marty's tips on our website, abcnews.com.